Yeah. Wow. This is the honey super frames. Frames of honey should only be removed for harvesting as long as 90% of the comb is cut. In this video, I will share with you from harvesting up to the manual production of honey. So if you are interested, please keep on watching. It's Sunday morning. We are on the way to beekeeper's house, which he have beehives in their front and backyard. We are nearby. A beehive is an enclosed structure in which some honeybee species are lives and raise their young. Though the word beehive is commonly used to describe the nest of any bee colony. This is one of the beehives of Miss Anne's mother. Total they have five beehives. <laughs> Honey bee harvesting, you must have some hat with net and clothes protection for any bee stings. I may not have a proper PPE, but I am just a assistant for this day and a watcher. But at least I have some protection. After wearing some PPE, so now let's get started with harvesting the honey in step-by-step -step process. Disclaimer, Mamita's not an expert but I will only share what I witnessed on this moment. So I have this protection hoping that the honey bee will not come to me. Kring <laughs> na! <laughs> wow, full honey, okay? Wow. Yes. So I have six orders. So <laughs> wow, dear low color, full yeah. honey. Wow! <laughs> Normally, the honey is stored by honeybees in their beeswax honeycomb in frame beehives. The honey is stored on a wooden structure called a frame. This beehive have six wooden frames. The honey frames are typically harvested in the late summer when they will be most filled with honey. On a completely filled frame, the cells will be cupped over by the bees for storage. That is, each cell containing honey will be sealed with a cupping made of beeswax. So this is the last step, the honey extraction. It's the central process in removing honey from honeycomb so that it is isolated in a pure liquid form. 
As you can see, after few manual spins, you will remove and reverse the frames and continue with honey extraction. But they will not extract the full honey, so they have some leftover for the bees. Now we are going to collect the three remaining wooden frames from the same beehive. Maybe, uh, the maybe the this black one, but this is Indonesia. Yeah, Indonesia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mamita would like to try this honey extraction. Okay, okay, don't go. Stop, yeah. Join another side. Join another side, yes. Yeah. Oh, smell honey, huh? Not strong, okay. Uh, <laughs> many inside. So that this one is only one part. Okay, now this is the second one. Woo! What do honeybees collect? Honeybees collect pollen and nectar as food for the entire colony, and as they do, they pollinate plants. Nectar stored within their stomachs is passed from one worker to the next until the water within it diminishes. At this point, the nectar becomes honey, which workers store in the cells of the honeycomb. I'm the assistant. The final step in the honey making process is storage. The honey is deposited into the cells of the honeycomb where it will stay until the bees are ready to eat it. To keep the honey fresh, each cell is capped with beeswax. Making beeswax is another fascinating process. Now you can see the honey. Wow, so many. I ordered six bottles. This is the good harvest quality. Mm. So repeating the uncapping of beeswax and honey extraction process. Oh, 
five six hundred fifty mil and eight bottles of five hundred mil for the three hives of honey. <laughs> It was a great experience to visit the honeybee harvesting and extraction process. Thank you Ms. Anne and Mr. Nam as well as to your parents that gave me this opportunity and allowed me to create this content that I can share with others out there who may be interested to be a beekeepers in their own backyard and it is not necessary to have a big area or farm if for own use only. I must say I have a wonderful time with you guys including our lunch together that prepared by your mom and your neighbors. Thank you, Mr. Min, for allowing me to be your assistant on that day. Fresh and pure honey <laughs> from Miss Anne's 